Good morning, good evening to you everybody. This is Flair with Runas, and last episode we got beaten up again. So that's two for two to the game. Let's go with a more... well, I'm going to go with my more favoured start, which you, know, you probably all know if you've seen any of my other episodes, which is Cunning of the Depths, Druid, Corruption. Standard, with a bit of a debuff. Buff, debuff, everything. <laughs> Let's get going. Ooh, we're in the cave. That's rare. Okay. Because normally I get kind of the forest uh, as a start, but uh, the cave is one that I don't get as often. Ooh, and the slightly more... Oh, I don't know what the right word to use. Um, melancholy, suspenseful music. Which I enjoy a lot. Okay, let's go. Damn it! I gotta drop it. Nice. So that's all them dealt with. And him. And this one. And that one. Okay. Go, go, go. Die. Alright, oh, oh, more rats. Oh, more. I didn't see you, you little git. Okay. Whoa, whoa. I backed myself into a corner there, that was really stupid. It's annoying having that one rat going around on the top and everything else on the bottom because that he was kind of limiting my exit. Okay. Oh, we've got an earth ring. Cool. And hopefully this time we'll actually get some proper... Well, we'll get to a triple combiner this time because last time, uh, when we died... I didn't even find the boss, good gods. Um, I just realised that. Um, yeah, hopefully we'll actually get to see a triple spell made this time. It's embarrassing for me if, uh, if we don't. And that health pack there is going to be really annoying to pick up, so I'll probably just cut that out when I'm doing the editing, if I have to go back for it. I'm sure what you want to see is action and spells and mad combos, not lots of boring backtracking and walking and stuff like that. Damn chaos mages. Okay, there's that burrow went down. Pack now. Okay. Let's see. There's some light rages, some mind rages, burrows, rats. Eh, not the worst. If it gets to a point where there is a horde of rats, which I would say is probably when we get to five or more in a confined space, that's annoying to deal with. But, uh, at least. They're better than bats, because they... Uh, well, yeah, bats will just go all over the place. And then after bats, it goes to swarmers slash speedsters. For uh, annoying, fragile enemy of the game. So that's what they are. In any game... Yeah. In any kind of dungeon game, you have rats and you have slimes. And their job is to make things annoying and difficult without providing too much... Well, to make things annoying without um, wasting too much time. That's the way I see them, in any case. Because you always get them, they're kind of stalwarts of the dungeon crawl roguelike genre. It's not a slime, it's not worth the time. Well, it doesn't have a slime. Ne never mind. I was trying to go for something rhythmically iterative to go along with, with that train of thought, but I obviously couldn't think of anything. Uh, let's go with some reduced cooldowns and keep on. Okay, so it sounds like. Yep. Oh, Mama Crawlers. Hello. Oh, and. Oh, yeah, let's get our power of the wilds on. Get rid of these zombies. And this portal. 
or shrine rather. Oh damn, that was a big burst. Stupid baby crawlers. So so skittering. Okay. Last one. Is she a champion? Oh god, a tough crawler mama. That's just what we need. But well, actually I've got how the world's up again, so let's drop that. At least the babies aren't out. Champions too. Okay, let's... Oh. Probably didn't need to take that damage here. Let's fill up. Okay. And it's dead end here, so let's head back out. Don't want to get back up with that. Smash those. You never know, you might get a rune. Get a rune, sorry. I think I... My accent just missed out the T there. I'm really sorry. Oh god! Yeah, that's that's an, an annoying thing. Ow! Yeah, that's that's a horde there. That's a horde. Oh god. Ah. And with the champ oh yeah. I don't like this. I don't like this at all. I don't like this at all. Oh okay, get off, get off, get off, get off. Stupid that. That stupid zombies. Everything. Oh get here. You're flying right And the last one. Finally. Gods. Yeah, my heart rate went up a little bit when I saw those bats, because that is exactly the kind of situation you don't want when you enter a room. It's just amusing. Because that is the definition of a horde and or swarm, right there. Hey, Magic Wrangler. Third time. Wow. Okay. Uh, oh, no. Oh. Get off. Okay, kill, kill, kill this. Kill this asshole. Oh, hell. was lucky and let's see um yeah let's go to class specialization here and maybe some density i think yeah that seems like a good a good choice because i don't want to be so i think getting knocked around is very annoying in this game because it really puts you out of position especially with some spells like um, the wind hunter for instance I think density affects his pull on that spell, or on their spells, uh, for that one, so, yeah, could be useful having that, hope it is. Let's get rid of this, there we go, that goes down, and speed mage down, okay, let's break everything here, and go, miss. Burn this so we can get to the next room quicker. Okay. There we go. And Buff's still going. Which is excellent. Well, for a second, but it shows some time off things. And I'm impatient, man, so. Okay, get off, get off, get off, get off. Get off. Oh. That one's down. Chaos mages. Really annoying. <sighs> They're probably the. Uh, I'd probably classify them as my most annoying type of novice mage. Because uh, that arc for Chaos Bolt is just huge. 
It's one of the reasons why I don't tend to use Chaos Bolt as a spell myself. Because it's a little bit unreliable where it actually goes. I mean, buffing it up does decrease the arc of it, so it is very useful. And I have seen people do um, double chaos runs to start off with, because it does do a lot of damage, I will admit that freely. And it's just not my cup of tea exactly, because I like to have a little bit more control over where the spells go. Well, I like to have control when they're kind of single shot. Um, base damage spells. If it's something like, if it's a much bigger something like uh, Phoenix Rain, for instance, which I don't think I've shown you guys here, but uh, that one is basically a send it and go and start dodging kind of thing, basically, because it's um, well, let's just say it's. A spell that doesn't just damage enemies, so you've got to be on your toes with that one, but it does a lot of damage, and you can at least see where it's going to strike first, so that's something. But yeah, it's kind of just a chaos bolt, it's a low level spell, and I like to have a little bit more control over those kind of basic shots. Uh, what should we go with here? Uh, ghost Walk? The way I've been handling things recently, I feel Ghost Walk would probably be a good idea, but, uh, hmm. I like Underdog. I do like Underdog. It's a nice, solid ability. Great for when you're down, uh, or in your, a slightly compromised position. So, I think, I would assume that means, say, um, if you're under the, the effect of a slow, as a for instance, that would uh, help there. Okay, let's... Get our uh, power of the wilds going. Dodge all these morphos. Out of the way. Okay, out of the way, out of the way, out of the way. Go, 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 go. Ooh. Oh, it's never, never good when you have speed mages in a significant arc of each other around. So I'm going to say is when you've got one above you and one to the left of you, or low and to the right or something like that. Whenever there's a significant angle between their incoming shots, it's very annoying. Because those shots, that kinetic ball is fast. It's, that is the entirety of... It's called kinetic ball, what do you expect? Okay, now what I'm going to do is I'm going to cut here for a second and to grab the health pack and I'll nip back when we're getting to here. Okay, see you in a second. And we're back. I also picked up that health pack over here, um, if you're wondering. Okay, let's go to floor two. Let's see, yep, remember to use your class ability often. Absolutely, that is why I picked the druid, because it's a really good one to use often. Let's quickly bust up all these. Okay, triple split, that's going to be a bit annoying to deal with, but hopefully one of these ways will turn me fairly quick. Oh, oh god. Oh god. Oh, just hell, hell with this room. Good gods. Ah. Oh, so many speed. This, this is the kind of room I hate. The speedsters do a shit ton of damage. And yow. Yeah, see, ow. Good gods. Little bastards. Uh, this is probably not gonna. How the walls may not help here, because if they hit me with my defense down, it's just gonna shit all over me basically. But okay, we've got all rid of them. Thank God. Okay. Haven't had a double combiner drop. Nope. Uh, uh, not in the mood for that. Normally, I would maybe, but um, oh, nice storage room actually. We have no, we do not have two bare rooms, which is what I prefer in this case, because it helps to have at least two spells with uh, the spawning pits event, especially if they've got a lot of knockback. Preferably if they have a lot, a lot. There, there. Got a lot of knockback. My tongue is just not working today. 
that bat speedy? I can't... Oh, he might have died. Oh, God. Oh, gosh. I don't think I... Oh. I'm actually dodging quite well at the moment, which is astonishing. Okay. Oh. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Oh, nuts. That, that one hit me. Oh, God. And I'm being hit again. Ah. Very little health going down here. Okay, come on. Okay, well, there's another health pack from wherever. I think it's just pretty destructible. Frankly, as long as I get health packs of any kind, I'm, I would be happy right about now. But, there we go. Right, okay, let's go up here. More. Oh, you got to be kidding. Three wind hunters? Oh, you assholes! Aye, aye, aye. Oh, God, and a bat as well, just to get in there and make things difficult and similar. Ah! God damn it. Oh, well. So much for that run, I guess. Uh, see you next time. Uh, good day, good night to you all. Um, it's been Flair, and I have been sucking for your entertainment. Bye!